Hey guys, welcome back for another episode of Clash of Clan on the Swill Entertainment Channel. All right, so I actually have uh, actually working on my Town Hall Nine right now, and I think what was going on. I think I got my barbarians up, so my barbarians are finally level six. So now I can do my barch again with ease. All right, so that's need to get some more elixir so I can go ahead and get my archers up. And that's going to be another four million gold. I mean elixir. I mean sorry. All right, so in the past. We just did a, actually we got another war going on, but we just started another, uh, actually did a friendly challenge. So let's check out what's going on with that. And we did that with our friends at YouTube Lord. And you know, it was kind of a blowout, but it was still fun. So we got 30 on us, 13 on them. So let's check out a couple of these little attacks that we have going on right here. So let's check out, no walls. And Nappy Boy attacked this dude right here. So let's go ahead and check out that replay. And this guy, Nesh, Nesh, <laughs> he really has no walls. So Nappy Boy brought in 15 giants, one archer, wall breaker, which I don't think he really needed, uh, some wizards, and some uh, and some hog riders, which is pretty much overkill. All right, so it looks like, oh, never mind. He does pull the clan castle. So he pulls the clan cast all the way out. So let's go ahead and speed it up a little bit because we don't want this to be a long drawn out video because this was a pretty much, pretty much a blowout. Like this base was awesome, but you got no walls, bro. Where are your walls? All right, so that was an easy three star right there. And a good thing about the friendly challenge, which I've really never done because neither one of the clans have done a friendly challenge is that you don't use your troops. Once you have them made, you don't have to worry about them again. You don't have to be like, oh man, I gotta make more troops. You just keep on going, guys. I had no idea. So let's check out my man Radio and what he did on Lady Aslan. All right, this base is pretty, a pretty popular design. This is what I used to use when I was Town Hall 4. I think she's Town Hall 4. Yeah. All right, so he doesn't really pull the clan castle or forgets about it. And he's like, oh, snap, I could tell. <laughs> All right, so basically, let's go ahead and speed it up. All right, so he does have a Valkyrie in the in his uh, clan castle brings everything in there had the balloons balloons do some work Valkyrie helps out big time and this base is pretty much done with the walls intact pretty much guys it's got one exit one entrance and one exit all right so that one's a three star there all right so let's check out General Hobbs Killer King 101 all right, so this is like the same base that Lady Aslan had. All right, so good Town Hall 4. He goes in there with the dragons. Like straight murder in this base. I mean, he he went ahead and took care of those clan castle troops with ease. Like, it was awesome. All right, so the dragons go around the base. He's got P.E.K.K.A.s in there. P.E.K.K.A.s and dragons. I like that composition. I never tried it, but I might try it now. And the P.E.K.K.A.s let them know that, hey, this, is, this base is just... I'm gonna get eaten up just like that boom 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 and boom all right so definitely want to do that all right so let's check out Lord CS which is uh, Lord Stevens alternate account I think it's Town Hall 5 I think all right so let's see Killer King 101 this is his second attack uh, he didn't really pull the clan castle as much. All right, so in there with the dragons again and the Pekkas as well. So they're just going straight for the middle, going for that good old town hall. Done. Got the air defense. Done. Got the ground defense. Done. And that base, he just went like through it, the whole deal, man. Just in and out, guys. It's almost like food, man. It goes in the mouth and comes out the butt. All right, so he's trying to get the rest. He got 18 seconds left, 15 seconds left. Is he going to make it? I'm sure he will. Done, done, and done. All right, so there we go. And we 
we got Super Ness. Three star by Mr. Happy. Now this base right here was amazing. Look at this. Got the clan castle getting pulled out already. That's the only problem is the clan castle was out. If it was inside a little bit, that would have been okay. But it still was a good, I like the design. It's not bad. So let's speed it up a little bit. This is like one of those oh crap moments when you see the clan castle come out. You're like, oh snap. Alright, so we fight dragon with dragon. And then everything just comes out. Look at that. The hog riders, they do their thing. Throw a little hill spell in there. Clan castle, not clan castle, but the, uh, yeah, clan castle's down. Town hall's down. Let's see, is there anything else on the edges? Nope. Alright, done. Alright. Alright, and we're going to check out Lord Blaze. Three star by my man, Long Walkway, which is a fresh, brand new Town Hall 7, mind you. Brand new Town Hall 7. Like, literally right before this clan, this friendly war happened, he turned Town Hall 7. Alright, so let's go ahead and speed up a little bit. It's pulling the dragon with the dragon. Alright, so he goes in there and just mercs everything, basically. Throws a heal spell on there for the dragon because of the air defense. Air defense is down. Yep. This goes right around the base. <laughs> awesome. He's one of our great players there that we have. Alright, let's check out Mr. Happy. Mr. Happy. Another attack here. And this base right here looks very intimidating. I wouldn't want to attack it myself. Alright, so he pulls the clan castle. The level 1 king is over there just wondering what's going on. He's confused. He's like, hmm, what's going on over here? Let's go see. Let's go in there. Which he should really be running another way. Hog Riders go in there and do their thing. Take out pretty much all the defenses by themselves. Which leaves the Giants really nothing to do. Dragon goes in there. Does his thing. He's still alive. Bam, bam, and bam. Bam, 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 bam. Awesome. Awesome. It's awesome. Alright, so Mr. Lord Stevens. Dark Vader. This base looks nice. Other than the gray walls, this base looks nice. This is a really good design. And let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, he goes in there with the Valkyries and the and the Wizards, which is a very good composition that I used to use a lot. And let me see. He actually is Town Hall 9 doing his attacks. Got level 2 Valkyries, level 5 Wizards. So he's good. Short work of the base. All right, so there we go. Now keep in mind, guys, these are people that used to be in Swill. So this is a this is a good friendly war, man. This is I would definitely do more wars with these guys. Um Alright, so these two, these last actually the last three bases were the hard ones. I ain't I'm not gonna lie. Dark Vader goes for number two, Rocky. These are some hard bases, guys. They put up a really good fight. If you guys are liking this content that you see. Definitely subscribe to the Swill Entertainment channel. And also you can check out Lord Stevens Gaming as well. He's an up and coming YouTuber, so you guys can check him out too. Don't forget to hit subscribe on him as well. So subscribe for both channels to see the best in content. Alright, so there we go. And we're gonna do one more attack here. We got we got P Revol done by yours truly, guys. So of course I go in there with balloons. You know me, I love balloons and uh lava hounds. I definitely need to get my lava hounds at level two. It's going to be so much easier to farm. Now, I go through here, and I, don't, I look at the base. I'm just like, yeah, I'm not going to get this. I see the dragon come out. I'm starting to freak out at this point. I'm just like, oh, my God. This ain't going to happen. All right, so Lava Pups pop. And I used to think Lava Pups popping was a bad thing, but you know what? That's actually a good thing. Let them pop. Because they take out the dragon. Rather than the dragon taking out the balloons. But I had no idea this was going to be a three-star. I didn't know. Because I was like, oh, my God. The dragon comes out. He's raping my troops right now. My king and my queen are going around. And, yeah, we're still going. And I still got Lava Pups up, which is like, oh, wow. I thought those were already done. So I'm over here hoping for a pop. That's what you want to do. When you have your Lava Pups, you want pops. Because that's where they do their damage. Right now, they're like, they're weak. They don't do any damage right now. So you just want them to go through and do their thing. They're ting-a-ting-a-ting. -ting. All right, so they're going through. Surgical, man. Like, this space is, like, still going. I'm like, this is not done yet. <laughs> So at this point, I'm just like, all right, cool. Lava Pup just popped. They don't have enough defenses up to pop my Lava, my lava um, Hounds. 
No defenses are up left. So I'm over here like, okay, this is going to take forever. King is still up. My queen is still up. Pop the king's ability, of course. We're in the center of the base. Lava pups on the outside, pretty much. There's two just doing some work. And the rest of them come out there to do some help. The queen is like, oh my god, let me do some work. I can't do anything inside here by myself. So she's in there just trying to bust down the walls, the balloons, and the lava pups are doing their thing. The queen makes it around. She passes a couple of the uh, ballistics there. And that's pretty much all she wrote. There we go. All right, so let me see here. I don't think everybody did their attacks. So pretty much they didn't have everybody do their attacks either. So they have Mr. Rocky, Lord Eshin, Super Ness, and No Walls didn't do any attacks at all. Lord CS didn't do their second attack. Lord Hobbs, Lady Aslan, Lord Eshin. Yeah, I remember Lord Eshin. He never did his attacks when we did when he was in our clan either. <laughs> I was always frustrated because I was like, dude, do your attacks. But they never do their attacks. But yeah, that's YouTube Lord versus Swill. Nothing else can be said. All right, so this is the stats here. Um, we lost one attack. They lost three. We did 17 that we won. Uh, we used 18. They used nine. So they did, only did half of what we did. So they could have got a lot more points if they would have done their if they would have done their attacks. And I thought they were going to actually give us more more than what they actually did. But the thing, like I said, the people don't do their attacks, and they pretty much they're consistent on not doing their attacks. So that's what happened. That's their downfall. Um, we are average destruction at 100. Um, their average destruction 81.5. Um, the most heroic attack was done by Long Walkway. Long Walkway. Their most heroic attack was P. Revol, and their most heroic defense was Rocky. And we didn't have a most heroic defense because I guess not enough attacks were in place. All right, so that's what's going on with Swill and YouTube Lord. Hopefully, in the future, we can do another friendly war. Definitely want to look forward to that. All right, guys. If you guys enjoy this content, make sure you guys subscribe, like the videos if you like them, and leave some comments down below. And we'll see you guys next time.